Hello YouTube and Mr. Forks, welcome to another Final Cut Pro 10 tutorial. And wow, we're wrapping these up. Um, basically, I just want to share absolutely everything so that by the time you finish this training series, you will be you will be fluent in Final Cut Pro 10 language. In this tutorial, we're just going to cover briefly layer modes, blending modes, as it were. These are available in most applications. I believe they originated in applications such as Photoshop, uh, then became available in After Effects and loads of other compositing, and then editing programs. And in Final Cut Pro 10, they are arguably easier than ever. And I mean easier than Vegas. I know Vegas is pretty, uh, I think, right clickable blending modes. Don't uh, quiz me on that. So you can see here in the timeline, I've actually got two shots on top of each other. Now, you don't have to have this, but obviously that's where we're going to see the most effect of a blending mode. Now if we just click this button here to show the inspector, you can see that if we scroll to the bottom to the opacity and compositing section, um, section, you can see there is actually a scroll bar here that says blend modes. Well, not a scroll bar, but a drop down box. And in here are all your blend modes. So we can press add. And you can see now that this image has been added over the top using some of the darker ranges or the lighter ranges. Screen is quite a common one. This basically uh, literally just dips the opacity of your image. Works quite well. You've got overlay. This kind of creates a hard mix using some of the darker tones. But really, you just want to go through and play around with these and see which ones you like best. Now, Obviously, for editing like this, when it's straight narrative, uh, we're trying to say what's going on, it's not common to find layer modes. However, for fancy stuff, for artsy images, and even just for uh, layering up stuff, maybe you've got some kind of sunset and you want it to blend into another shot, just to create some kind of artistic merit to your film, uh, then blend modes are very good, they're very accessible, and they're all here in the inspector.